My name is Kevin Rule, and I'm from Mount Michael. And the title of my poem is, In Chennai, India, my grandfather buys rice and a stuffed bear for a father and his son. An ice cream smudge on my nine-year-old face, eggshell white contrasting caramel brown. Across from me, grandfather, white shirt parted at the collar, gold chain hanging loosely as an untied shoelace. As the last glob of ice cream plummets into my stomach, we slowly rise and exit. The street surges with people, the way dead leaves cover the ground on an October afternoon. Smells of marvelous food sweep the air, making it hard for me to breathe. The voices were louder than rain beating down on a metal ceiling. Cosmic colors were everywhere, making the city look like a giant color wheel. On the side of the street, we noticed a middle-aged man missing his left arm, screaming for money. Next, his boy missing his left leg. Both are shirtless, the boy's dusty skin making the, shimmer on, making the red shimmer on a bright sun. His bones through his tight skin, cadaverous as the limbs of a newborn tree. His hair slick as if someone dumped olive oil all over his head. His shorts strained around his hip, making it look like his chainmail. The father's long black beard is riven with strands of white hair, like strands of cloth. His ribs jut out, visible to everyone willing to not look away as bags under his eyes try to stay attached to his face. And I looked at his feet, scarred and dried as burnt toast. My grandfather calmly asked this man and his child their story. The father spoke, his voice tremoring like a skinny tree on a windy day, and he said, I was a cop. I threw someone in jail, hoping to bring peace and happiness to this ungrateful city. The gang of this man took my son and cut off his leg. They took me and they cut off my arm. One night, they took torches to my house and all I could see was fire.